Big weekend downtown is Indianapolis gears up for the Indy Classic Colts, uh, the Indy Classic and the Colts game. Yeah, and our Angelica Robinson joins us live from downtown Indy, where, of course, they're they're preparing right now. Hey, Angelica. Guys, yes, uh, Gainbridge will host the Indy Classic, and restaurants and businesses around here are expecting a lot of revenue, a lot of people coming in to watch those games over the weekend. Thousands of people will be will be taking the streets, and some going into those bars and restaurants uh, to to watch the game and cheer on their favorite Indiana teams. Now we said a Saturday Colts game, which is a Colts game, which is different than the usual Sunday game, uh, where they take on the Steelers in the afternoon, and at the same time, the Indy. Classic Classic tournament will be underway with Ball State taking on Indiana State and Purdue taking on the number one team in the country, Arizona, later that afternoon. That means a lot of fans and potentially a lot of extra cash for workers at restaurants nearby. We do this large crowds a lot here in Indianapolis. Indianapolis is a great place to host events, as everybody knows. Everybody involved in Indianapolis bringing events here does a great job, and it's a showcase worldwide how good Indianapolis is. So my staff is very excited, and it's a perfect time to make extra money during the holidays. Now, O'Reilly's is hosting the Indiana State Alumni Association, so that place will be packed. And if you're cheering on the Sycamores, that'll be the place to be. All right, Angelica, thanks very much. Looking forward to this weekend. Lots of people coming to town, and we will see you again at 5 o'clock. And a heads up.